the summer of 2005, Morgan and I were awarded a Eugene O'Neill Foundation commendation for our work in the field of playful television banter. We spent most of the prize money on soda pop and comic books. And how about a donkey? His name was Alfredo. Mm -hmm. But since the money was technically a commission for a new work, we had to throw some together so the IRS wouldn't come knocking at our doors. The result was a brave new artistic form that has delighted millions and electrified fans of the thespian arts. Please enjoy yet another edition of Splinter Cell Co-op Theater. When America needs a hero. When freedom stands alone. When justice needs to be upheld, there's only one place to turn. Through the cover of night, America's top agents will defend our liberty from those who wish us harm. Let us join Special Agent Bob and Secret Agent Steve, two of the finest official unofficial splinter cells. When you get caught between the moon and New York City. What are you doing? I'm just happy to have a mission here in New York. You know, instead of Korea or Botslakovania. Yeah, I don't think that's a real place. Hey, do you think I could hit a window on the Chrysler building? Why would you want to hit a window on the Chrysler building? You know, for reconnaissance. Uh-huh. Hey, look at those lights. Yeah, I wonder what those are for. Probably some tourist trap. And maybe they're landing lights. Yeah, probably. Yeah, whatever, let's do this. Okay, move me to your left. Uh, your your other left. Right, yeah. Okay, thanks. Keep, keep going. Could you hurry it up? Look, I'd let you repel if I could hold your tubby ass up. I mean, Jesus, it's like lowering an elephant. They usually have cranes for that sort of thing. Oh, come on, it's the holidays. Everybody puts weight on around yeah, the... Yeah, the holidays at John Merrick's house. Now be quiet, Daddy has some spy work to do. Whoa! Okay, so uh, I'll just hang out up here then. I didn't want to do the mission anyway. Guess I'll just look at the tourist lights. Oh, for f sake, will you just find another way in? I bet if I told you there's a box of donuts in here, you could figure it out. Pew! 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 <laughs> pew! Pew! Shut the f up! Sorry. Found another way in, but you have to open the door. How the hell am I supposed to know where you are? Hold on. Pew! Uh, there's some dude on the floor. Boy, that, that really narrows it down. Thanks. Look, just th look through my optic cable. We can do that? Yeah, it's like that movie Lady Hawk. Oh, I love that movie. Becker Howard was awesome before he got fat. It's enough with the fat jokes. Hey there, okay, I see you. Where? Here. Where the f*** is here? I mean, did they give you your own zip code or something? What's the number? No, damn it, Bob, you know where I'm at. Are you in here? Ah! Oops, man, I'm sorry. <laughs> I thought your enormous size would prevent the door from opening. Bob, dying. Oh, right. You need insulin because your craving for sweets has left you diabetic. Ugh. You have diabetes too, you prick. Yeah, but I got mine the man way. Trying to drink myself to death. That almost worked, too. You locked us out, didn't you? I'm not gonna lie to you. I hate you so damn much. Come on, Lady Hawk, don't be that way. Shut up. What's taking so long, Lady Hawk? Some guard won't stop looking out the window. I can't believe he doesn't see me. I'm hanging right outside the ledge. Hello? Wait, you can you can hold your whole body weight up? Come here! You wanna see the skyline? Huh? Steve. Steve, what are you doing? Look! I said look! That's the Chrysler building! Is that what you were looking at? Jesus Christ, we need a safety word. Say you love it! Say you love it! Is that the safety word? Say it! I, I love it! Not you, Bob! Yeah, okay. Uh, base, this is Bob. Fatty's on the ice cream truck. I repeat, Fatty's on the ice cream truck. I'm gonna need backup and a big gurney. <laughs> Join us next week when Steve and Bob disarm more terrorists with their amazing cunning and stealth. Wow, that was a weird ending for Bob and Steve. Hey, you think that's weird? Check this out. Yeah, quiet. Yeah. Oh. Did you get anything out of him? Out? We're bad at our job. Drive safe, folks. Bye. I don't think the relationship is healthy. Oh, healthy relationships are for babies. All I'm looking for is a nice alcoholic to treat me wrong so I can get some good foundational memories for my country western career. You're gonna need bigger hair. Oh, wait. Just wait. Get ready to go inside the superhero of all conventions. It's Comic-Con 06 Live. Presented by Yaris. July 21st at 8, only on G4.